Hey guys and welcome to another Disney reading. Today we have Disney Pixar's Incredibles, a mission for Bob, and we have April 9th, if you can see that. Bob Parr had a boring job. Nobody knew that he was actually Mr. Incredible, a super who used to save people from disaster. Being a super had been banned many years ago, and Bob was trying to live a normal life with his wife Helen, or Elastigirl, as she was once known. One day at work, Bob wanted to help someone who was being mugged outside, but his boss wouldn't let him go. Bob was so frustrated at not being allowed to help that, um, uh, to help that he gave his boss a tiny push, but it carried all <laughs> of Bob's super strength. Wham! Bob's boss crashed through five walls, and Bob lost his job. Bob, it's like Bob's Bob, 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 Bob. Bob was worried. He didn't want to tell Helen he was fired. But what could he do without a job? At home, Bob was clearing out his briefcase. Suddenly a computer fell out. On the screen was a woman who had secretly watched Bob save people from a fire the night before. Helen didn't know, but Bob had started using his superpowers again. My name is Mirage. I respect, uh, represent a top secret division of the government, she said. A highly experimental robot has escaped our control. She had a very special top secret mission for Mr Incredible. Mirage told Bob that if he could stop the malfunctioning Omnidroid battle robot before it caused any damage, he'd be paid three times his yearly salary. Bob accepted. He needed the, he needed the money, but more importantly, he needed the adventure. Not sure that's more important, but... Bob knew Helen wouldn't approve, so he told her he was going on a business trip. He was taken to the island of uh, Nomancia... Nomancian? Nomancian? We've all seen the film about a thousand times, I don't know why I can't pronounce it. Nomancian, we just call it that. Where Mirage told him to shut the robot down and do it quickly. And don't die, she added. Mr Incredible soon met the robot and the fight began. The Omnidroid was a fast learner when it came to defending itself, but in the end Mr Incredible tricked it into destroying itself. Mirage and her boss watched the robot's defeat. Surprising, said her boss. After a celebration dinner with Mirage, Bob flew home. He was excited about getting back into super work. He began to lose weight, bought a new car and even played with the kids more. It's a bit harsh. Things were looking up, but he'd ripped his suit, so he decided to visit Edna Mode, the former fashion designer for the supers. She agreed to mend the old suit for sentimental reasons, but insisted on making him a new, bold, dramatic outfit. Bob was excited about what the future might hold. <laughs> so guys, if you like that story, click like. If you'd like to see more, click subscribe. And the next story will be Toy Story 2, Woody's Decision. Okay, bye.